It is a story that could have had a very different ending. A hang glider in Marion County has a close encounter with a tree and lives to tell the tale. Good evening, I'm Kim Chapman. And I'm Josh. Wrote tonight, hang gliders react to what happened to News Channel 9's Alyssa Sparato joins us now with the story. Alyssa. Kim and Josh, Marion County Sheriff Bo Burnett says it all happened along Old Dunlap Road in Whitwell this afternoon. He says a hang glider clipped a tree and called for help, but luckily when rescue crews got there, the hang glider was already out and wasn't hurt. But his experience is reminding others to be safe in the skies. Hang glider enthusiasts say if it's not the rush, it's fulfilling their lifelong dream that keeps them coming back for more. I wanted to fly since I was three years old. So when he hears a fellow hang glider has a close call in the skies. If somebody was up there with just a buddy, it would be tough on him. But because there's probably 30 people up there, we have rescue gear at all of our sites that you can open up and get harnesses for repelling down and doing things like that. But for others, it brings them back to years before. For Catherine Gagnon, she says for a second she felt invincible and lost sight of the windy conditions on a flight six years ago near the same spot where it happened today. My heart was racing and it was rowdy conditions, but I, I didn't end up in the trees that day. But I remember, I remember from that close call that, okay, you can never get complacent with hang gliding. But regardless of the conditions, both Eid and Gagnon say safety always comes first. But I listened to my inner, inner feeling today not to fly my hang glider because it's a big inner wing that I have here and uh, I knew the wind would be too strong for me to get to the, the, the landing field that I feel comfortable landing in it. Especially in a place like Whitwell where conditions can become hazy. Because of the trees in the way it's not a consistent airflow and if you come off the ramp without enough airspeed to support your wing you don't have control of the glider and the wind will blow you in to the wall. Now I had a chance to speak with a board member from the Tennessee Tree Choppers who told me the hang glider's experience actually isn't all that uncommon.